Hi everyone, uh, Chris here from Time Navi. I'm just going to walk you through how to use and the features of the add-on. So first of all, I've already created some activities here for this fake calendar that I'm just using. What I'm doing is I'm using the red color, tomato, to track my sales. I'm using lavender to track my meetings and I'm using blue, or light blue to track my client prep. Um, you just do this by going to add activity the bottom right. You can select the, the color that you want to track, or if you don't find any color that you like there, you can track a new color. So let's just say that I want to track anything that's got banana in it. Or you can track by a word titles. So this is kind of like an and function here. So it could be meeting, comma, and work, and sales, and client. And so this will track anything in the title that has meeting, work, sales, or client. But I'm going to just do banana for the moment. Um, I'll name my activity generic work. Go to the next step. I'll skip setting a goal for this week. And now my activity of generic work shows up here. I can just, if I let's just say I add an event called um, filming, like so. I color it in banana, save, and then I refresh the add on. Now my hours for generic work are being tracked. Yep. I can export this all to sheets, of course, like so. And now all my calendar events have shown up into uh, Google Sheets. You can also scroll right and there will be pie charts and different graphs to your right as well. Um, they take a little bit of time to load, but they, they're there. Uh, they will appear here. What I want to show you next is the dashboard. So we also have a dashboard that's just been released that you can use to understand your time in more depth. Here you can see it in more depth where you've got different colors, activities, by calendar, by attendee, and that way you can get more to know about your time. We've got coming soon a team dashboard where you can track activities over multiple calendars, um, which will be an exciting new feature to have. Thank you so much. Bye.